let's start with the inventory report under the report section. This report gives an easy to understand intuitive view of inventory status of all products across all of your stores. The options at the top allow you to filter data by store or by product or by product group. You can also filter data based on the inventory levels. The data in the report can be filtered for products which are in stock, low on stock, have critical stock levels or have zero or negative stock. Products which have zero or negative stock are highlighted by the red button on the status column. Let's now look at the inventory transactions section. This section lists all of the back office transactions that a store manager will be required to perform. The purchase order screen allows you to create a purchase order for a vendor. Click on add purchase order. Specify the store for which the products are being ordered. Specify the vendor and the required delivery date. Add products by either typing their description in the selection box or you can also add products by using the import template. You can add special instructions for individual products or can specify instructions and comments for the entire purchase order. Similarly, you can also add additional surcharges like freight to individual products or to the entire purchase order. Click Save and the purchase order is successfully created. Once the goods are received, you can click on the trolley icon in the purchase order list to receive the products. Tagrain allows you to edit the quantity being received. Specify the received quantity and click on save to complete the goods receipt. This will update the inventory levels of the products that we have just received. Let's now move to stock transfers. This is very helpful when you need to move stock from one store to another. Under inventory transactions, select stock transfer and click add stock transfer. Select the from store and then select the destination store. Start adding products by typing their description. Specify the quantity and add any special instructions and click save to add the stock transfer. If you need help at any point feel free to contact our 24 by 7 support team. You can also click on the help icon to read more about your topic of interest.